What's up, YouTube? It's your boy L Trey TV with another episode of All Hip Hop Slash Music All the Time. In today's episode, we're gonna talk about your boy Kodak Black. Yeah, Kodak. And we all know that Kodak is locked up right now. Free yak. Gleefer. But yeah, man, Kodak Black is locked up in jail right now. And I guess somebody called Kodak, and Kodak happened to do a freestyle over the phone, man. I love this about Kodak. Kodak is one of those guys who just continuously, continuously works, man. He just makes sure he's keeping his, his, you know, his, his craft sharp, man. But anyways, during the during the freestyle or whatever, man, Kodak said something about Young Miami. I guess. From what I heard, I'm taking from it that he used to talk to Young Miami, man. And, you know, they broke up. He said he got Young Miami a ring. And Young Miami went and bought 808, which he was referencing to Southside. That's her baby daddy and her husband or whatever, however that goes. I don't really know if they're married or not. But I know they, ha they have a baby on the way. So Southside... <laughs> Which is the guy, if you don't know who Southside is, he's he's with 808 Mafia, or he's in that group, a collective of instrumentals, beat makers, you know what I'm saying? The guy who, the people who make you, the people who make you bounce, the beat makers. Anyways, he made a video, you know, saying, you know, fuck Kodak Black, Kodak Black is suck a dick, you know what I'm saying? That's why your pussy ass in jail, you know what I'm saying? Uh, just talking noise to... To, to Kodak Black, man, because you know he has to defend his woman, which I, I, I understand. You know, you gotta understand. You gotta defend your woman, man. If you don't, man, you look weak. And she, I'm, pre I'm pretty sure she said something too, man. You need to defend my character. You need to defend my name. But anyways, what y'all think about that? And I wanted to also bring back up Kodak Black's work ethic. I. Like I said, I love the way that Kodak is still off in jail and he's writing because when he came out of jail that last time, man, he he had that Dying to Live album and I'm sure he wrote that in jail, man. And that album was fire. So I'm excited to see that he's still in there working and that when he hopefully when he come home, man, he have a notebook full of shit, man. And he ain't letting that whole jail thing get, get him in a depression or nothing like that, man. He's just steady in there working and just using that as some time to just be able to just work. You know what I'm saying? Just 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 work. But yeah, man, y'all let me know in the comments, man. Did Southside do the right thing? Was Kodak Black wrong or however this situation could be, man? Just let me know, man. It's your boy L Trey TV with another episode of All Hip Hop Slash Music All the Time. Like, comment, and share with your motherfucking mama. I'm out. Peace.